We carry our childhood experiences with us into adulthood. Everyone's experiences are different. Some are good, others are bad, and can affect us in a negative way. They're called Adverse Childhood Experiences, or ACEs. In this week's A Better You, Joey starts a three-part series explaining what ACE is and how you can find your ACE score. Hi everybody, it's Joey, and believe it or not, this is Nathan. And I'm not gonna talk very much because I don't wanna get in the way of your good message, but I just I just want the folks at home to know how really honored I am that you would come on the program today and talk about really how to be better from a different sense. I always talk about it like sit-ups and push-ups and don't smoke and eat right, And sure. but you're talking about something called ACE scores. Can you tell me and, and these guys what you mean by that? Absolutely. So thank you for having me on. My name is Nathan Staley. I am currently coordinating a grant on behalf of Healthy by Design. And Healthy by Design is a community coalition uh, working to tackle large health issues in our community. And so, you know, nutrition, physical activity, mental health, all that kind of well-being, right? It's all around the same topic, essentially. So what we're talking about today is really ACE scores, right? So what ACE scores, really what ACEs stand for are adverse childhood experiences. And what's important to realize is that the more of these adversities we face as children before the age of 18, the more at risk we are as adults for actual poor health outcomes. Mm -hmm. So it's important for us to, to know what, what ACEs are and to know our score essentially. So an ad adverse childhood experience, uh, an ACE score, may determine my behaviors as an adult. So behaviors as well as outcomes in health. So mm -hmm. essentially it's um, the score, it's a, it's a 10 question assessment that can be taken and it's just a simple yes, no. But it, you're, you're looking at really things that have happened to you when you, were, when you were growing up, right? And we're talking about big things. So abuse, neglect, different kinds of household dysfunction that, that, that really can affect our brain development, can affect us as adults and the way we behave as adults. That's huge. And I know that we don't have a lot of time to cover all of it. So we're gonna do this in several parts. I want you to tune in next week. Make sure you catch the definition, not only definition, but how to find out more on how you can participate in determining your own ACE score. Thanks so much, Nathan. Thank I'll you. I'll talk to you again soon.